such a big girl, cosplaying a superhero, laughing in the bat cave. But you hear it, don't you? Hear what? The real you, buried under the floorboards. Scratch, scratch, scratching to get out. The one who cut her friend's throats. Kicks. And laugh about it. That's <laughs> my girl. Oh, Harley. Always such a disappointment. Why do I bother? Ain't no slick fella with a cheap suit and cheap a grin telling me who I am ever again. We had mad love once upon a time. But now that's over, Mr. J! It's been years since the regime fell. Superman's behind bars. Damien. My own son is there with him. But we can't ever forget why we put them there. We must stay vigilant. I thought your goal was to reassure people, Mr. Wayne. You're not alone in rebuilding Gotham and Metropolis. But if we don't change some minds soon... Thought that's why you hired that overpaid PR firm, Lucius. Convincing folks to move back to these cities is a lot harder when they're afraid someone's gonna knock them down again. Superman's never getting out. I made that clear. But Wonder Woman, Black Adam, Aquaman, they're still out there somewhere. And seemingly immune to prosecution. I know you built Brother Eye to keep tabs on all those loose ends, but the public doesn't know. Brother Eye's secrecy is critical. Our enemies can't fight something they don't know exists. Well, then at least follow one bit of advice we paid those PR people so much money for. What's that? Be a little less Batman, a little more billionaire playboy. Get out around town in the daylight. And smile. Focus groups show people feel safer when they see you smile. Hmm. That would be your other job. Bruce, consider widening your circle of trust. Nobody wins all by themselves. Not even you. As a reception area, this place needs a lot of work. Dinah, Oliver, thanks for coming on short notice. You're lucky we found a sitter. My great-grandfather built the original Gotham Underground. But these days, it's the Batcave. And this is Brother Eye. More like the Eye of Sauron. Surveillance hub? More than that. A communications hub. Licking every satellite and server on the planet. It warns us when trouble's coming, and guides us when trouble's here. Must take a real genius to operate. I don't know about genius, but I do got a PhD. Dinah! Dinah's hobby! You sure came a long way. A world away. But the change of scenery is nice. I was surprised you called, Bruce. Things seem to be going well. So, what's up? Dismantling the regime created gaps in global security. We're covering them where we can, but we're stretched thin, vulnerable. Harleen, show them what you found. Right, old Beth. Gorilla Grodd, everyone's favorite talking ape. He's got himself a band of bozos. Calls them the society. My mole in Gorilla City says Grodd's planning something big. But what, where, when, we don't know. One thing we do know, 
Scarecrow's gonna ship Grot a buttload of fear gas from a hideout in Slaughter Swamp. Very mosquito-y. Good thing I packed my bug spray. I need you three to stop that gas before it gets to Grodd. Not joining us for the party? Unfortunately, I can't leave Gotham without worrying the public. Don't worry, Bats. With this crew on the job, what could go wrong? I know I'm the new guy, but you really trust Harley? She's a different person since Joker died. Mostly. Taking my head off because your boys are too slow. Fear not, Deadshot. We'll be ready for tomorrow's attack. Tomorrow? Cheeky monkey. Fancy meeting you here. Keep them moving. I'll see what that's about. Red! I ain't seen you in forever. You here to take down these punks? Quite the catch, Ivy. Red? You're with them? Your man, Bruce, was supposed to better care for the green. All he's done is remodeled the concrete jungles of Gotham and Metropolis. Where I sit, there's not much difference between him and Superman. Ugh. You're a few cones short of a pine if you think your new friends care about the green. Rod will keep his promises. Or he'll be my next victim. Oh, Red. Why are you making me do this? Let me get you out of here, girl. We can team up again. Drive all the boys crazy. You know, like the old days. The old days were fun. But these days, I'm all business. Begin. Prepared to be perforated. You're a thorn in my side. defend itself against doom. But even their greatest weapons were as nothing before doom's power. The heroes of your world also tried to stop doom and paid the ultimate price.
corrupt. And with this discovery, Doom began corrupting your entire world. Channel it into him! Destroyed. It's over. Yeah, I think you're right. It's good to have you back, Thor. Thank you, my friend. Call me Iron Man again, and I'll crush you. Where's Thanos? On the wind. Jetta? Jetta saw things my way. Eventually. You took a hell of a risk giving the Soul Stone to Ultron Sigma. Hm. Nah. So, what the hell happened? Uh, we won? Yeah, I get that. But with Ultron Sigma gone, shouldn't things go back to the way they were? Hm? No! Right. Time rewinds, the universes separate, the dead come back to life, etc., etc. This universe was forged with the space and reality stones. Only by their power could we undo all that's been done. And the reality stone is cracked. Then I guess we're stuck with each other. Rockets. What? I was just gonna, you know, take him for safekeeping. The stones are too dangerous to be borne by any one of us. Then between the heroes of both dimensions, we must share this burden. There shall be six custodians of the stones. Two entrusted to Earth, two to Exgard, and two to the Dark Kingdom. I pray that we never again need call upon their power. But if that day comes, we shall be ready. So what do we do now? We rebuild. We honor the dead. How? by protecting our new world, together. There's yet another way. Have you come seeking forgiveness, my love? Retribution. Thanos, there is no power.